From the busy streets of downtown Tokyo to the peaceful Chiba countryside is a train ride home for most commuters. But for some passengers, the destination is quite remarkable. As civil wars raged in Japan and sword skills were tested daily, a martial arts school was founded that continues today, 600 years later. A sword school so unique it is designated as a cultural asset. This is the Tenshin Shoden Katori Shinto Ryu, Japan's oldest school of classical bujutsu. To step inside is to travel back to the days of the samurai. Each set of movements, or kata, are designed to perfect cutting stroke and accuracy. There are no unnecessary gestures. The techniques are from real-life combat and have one purpose only, to kill. The squatting posture, for example, reduces the swordsman's visibility, especially on a moonlit road. Otake Riske is the world's most renowned master of the Japanese sword and the school's instructor. あの、戦国の時代には Several famous samurai enrolled at the school, and in the history of Katori Shinto Ryu, only one was killed in combat. The lethal killing techniques of the samurai are not taught just to anyone. Students must pass a rigorous test to prove loyalty to the school. あの、Signing a pledge in blood is to promise to abide by a code of conduct akin to Bushido, or way of the samurai, mandatory for those trained in the art of the sword. Trading steel for wood was widely adopted by the samurai to keep their sword skills sharp. By the late 17th century, as military conflict died out, the use of the boken in swordplay was the closest that most samurai came to actual combat. だから、だから、